okay welcome to student video tutorial youtube channel and in this uh, fourth part of bandit we are going to see this one level 2 to level 3 this one right and level goal is the password for the next level is stored in a file called spaces in this file name located in the home directory and commands we may need are ls cd cat file to find same same commands right and helpful reading material google search for spaces in file name right so i'm going to show you basic uh, example of uh, what this means at first i'll show you uh, what this means and how to access these files and then i'll uh, pass this one right so uh, at first uh, let's see the password for bandit 2 i have saved here uh, okay this one is the password for we did this right we did this so i'll just get i just log into bandit 2 that uh, level 1 to level 2 first right and let's do this bandit 2 we did this already right now we are doing level 2 to level 3 and let's paste that password and enter uh, okay you can see here we are logged in and then now let's do alias right uh, spaces in this file name right how to access this one now so before uh, accessing that i want you to show some basics right it's not a big deal to access this uh, this file and see what's inside that but at first do cat and then spaces in this file name uh, it can't access that right no source file or directory no source file or directory right so let's stop here and i will show you some basics so we got a new window let's go to desktop and let's create a file with touch command and let's place space there right uh, at first see t a o u c s touch space then test this what will happen now see here test this right two files have been created with this command but i want only one file okay now let's create one file name with space touch paste this and put this in double quote right enter now you can see here test this is single file open that and write something there write content example okay now save this try to access that directory cat command cat test this you will not see the content so see the to see the content cat ps to test this and remember this one i mentioned in here we will see the content right content example now next uh, way next method is to assign escape character right escape character is this one uh, which is also known as backslash right now let's assign that escape character backslash cat tst test backslash and then this now you can see the content right another method is using tab completion command line completion or programmable completion i'll show that in bandwidth ctf okay now let's get back to bandit terminal here and yell yes so here is the file species in this file name so we did cat but we got this error in this section so let's try with cat right and spaces in this file name and then enter then you will get the content of the file in this way and next method i have shown you is cat just remove this double quote and assign escape character backslash uh, 
spaces backslash in backslash this backslash and file name then you will get the content again here right and next final method is tab completion or command line completion or programmable uh, completion so let's try that and okay let's just skip it okay cat then sp tab and you can see that i press tab here i will do that again cat sp and tab in the keyboard then you will get this one automatically right so let's see the content again so this was uh, just a basic uh, creating these two files and creating this one file accessing this uh, this file was uh, uh, was not the part of the video but uh, for beginners or for who are beginners in this section of terminal about these uh, escape characters and accessing about the space files assigned with spaces so i gave basic and then i came back to bandit uh, ctf videos a bit long uh, okay thank you very much for watching